Hello, welcome back to War American Truck Sim. Maybe some more American Truck Sim. Please, some more American Truck Sim. Ah, American Truck Sim. doesn't work this time I'm going to steam the source which I'm already going to maybe this will work okay let's see if it works Um, yes, yeah, so it just finished. Ah, uh, now it needs to connect the Steam account. Alright. Alright, so, mod manager new mods found. Let's see what they are. I thought we already had all the new mods. Oh, I get it. It still thinks that there are mods because I didn't activate all of them. So... So, I forget what load we took. Oh, right. It was the middle of the night. We ended up crashing into a Walmart truck that we didn't find. That we couldn't see until, like, oh, no. Of course. Oh, no. We ended up in a Walmart truck. And we took a Schneider load. Yeah, so I was going to do Christmas Shopping Simulator, but I ended up doing other things between recording times, so yeah, that's why there's no Christmas Shopping Simulator. I was going to do Cross Country Flight, but Charlotte is a, um, a city, and cities equal lag, and lag equals game crashes. So I was tired of that, so American Truck Sim has never failed on me. So I know that... I'm Except maybe when it takes too long for the game to load, then maybe we have to reload it again. But other than that, it's never let me down. American Long Haul 2. Yes, yeah, so we're going from Reno to Barstow to bring a Schneider load back to the body shop in Barstow. So we're going to plan our route now, guys. Uh, to be there, I would more want to kind of go this way because it would be a sort of a oh this road goes over probably this road if because if I click on this road it makes you go all the way there oh this is the highway that's why so yeah we'll go this way and then that way and then get on the highway and then get back on it just at the expense of and then we're gonna go through Truckee Head down past Sacramento, go through Stockton. Oh, right, we already planned the route. <laughs> uh, yeah, then we're going around there, then headed up to Barstow, which is right there, which seems good. We're taking it. We're taking it. We're going to leave in the morning and deliver it at night. So... Hopefully the game will actually load. Yeah, I was doing um, some multiplayer yesterday, and I'm going to tell you some of the weird stories that happened yesterday. If this game shall ever load, which it just did. Okay, so cool. So I'll show you the load if you can see it, which you can't, because it's pitch black. Just look at the road textures. Uh, anyway, we're in Reno. 
We've got a one-ton return to body shop for paint load. Headed to HMS Machinery. Needs to be in tomorrow. S well, in game time, so... We have loads of time, and oh, shoot. Hold on a second, guys. Uh, I don't know what to do. Oh, we're gonna make it... Oh, cool, so that's gonna work out. Let's see, so which way does it want us to go? That way? Yeah, but then we have to go... Oh, forget it, we're going right anyway, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, but it doesn't matter, kind of the next light, so... Park and break off. Let's get out of here. We're making a right, so even if we were gonna try to fake it, it wouldn't work, because... Are you kidding me? That automatic blinker. Alongside my, uh, the, the steering sensitivity does not equal a good combination for fines. Okay, so... 30 miles an hour. Yeah, so I'll tell you some stories, but let's get on the highway first. Let's get through the city. And then we'll, uh, start to, uh, go through the multiplayer follies that happened. Alright. See what this load is. Heartland Express. Heartland Express. Alright, so we go through that light. Uh, then we're gonna head around here. What truck is this? It's just a gas. It's just a gasoline. Yes. Monitor intermodal. Yeah, we don't have the uh, this kind of trailer in where I live. Normally, you just have. Um, You have, like, the more, uh, the more metallic trailers. I don't know, how do you, how do you call it? Uh, they're more like the, like, smoother metal. I don't know what they're, it's called. Maybe this, maybe this is, like, I don't think this is metal, maybe, I don't know. I have really no idea. Alright, so... This is our truck. And where's the highway? Because we need to get onto the highway. And I was gonna do, and I was, but I would have done city skylines, but I did not even think of city skylines. So, <gasps> shoot. Alright, well, this is what the no damage mod is for, so that just in case we, in case the wheel slips up, we have backup. What I do wish is that there were, like, like, I just don't know how to, like, get, oh, well, I just wish that I could put the graphics up. But if I put the graphics up, this game's gonna be slower than it was when it was raining on our arrival into Reno last episode. So I think it's better if we just, uh... Jumps. All night talk show. I don't want to hear someone talk all night. Jeez, I think I would like pass out if I heard someone talk all night. Jeez, I'm trying to sleep. I'm not going to want someone to talk all night. <laughs> I'm actually joking because considering the fact that, uh... <laughs> you have the choice to listen to him or not. But still, I don't really fancy the idea of an all-night talk show. I'm not the one for an all-night talk show. I mean, who wants an all-night talk show? Oh, shoot. He <laughs> accidentally went into the, uh... I accidentally went into the code type box. Look, even in the even in American Truck Simulator, not just American Long Haul, in American Truck Simulator, they've got uh, trucks in the left lane. Now, of course, that guy is going is moving is moving very fast, but 
still doesn't matter. Stop! I forgot. I keep forgetting about the realistic physics. Thank heavens that this trucker is like not is uh, holding back. Don't worry. I'm getting in this lane anyway because I want you to pass if you get the chance. And plus, this person just got in the lane. So. This is going to be a very fun drive, I can give you that. I want to move over, because I want to. And... So let's see now, uh... It's the jingling axle of the UPS guy. As he drives past at quarter to four in the morning. Just why is the UPS guy dr bringing us packages at 4 a.m.? I thought that was the UPS. I thought that was the USPS job to deliver in the middle of the night. Whoa, this guy's a daredevil. This guy is a wannabe daredevil. I was just gr I was just like grasping onto that left turn signal cuz I thought we we're going to need it eventually and I didn't use the turn signal because we did not need it. Oh sh <laughs> Out of control. Your only solution is to just slam on your brakes. That's your only solution when it comes to going out of control. So it appears to the, me the fact that uh, this is probably going to be... Uh, um, our only trip, considering just look at how long it's gonna take us to get to Barstow. Looks like this might be the only trip we get into this episode. Unless we find a really short trip next up, I mean, in the next part, but unless that happens, we're not gonna be able to get another trip in. At least we fit into the crowd with a Nevada truck and a Nevada trailer. Because we've got a truck from Elko. No, we've got a truck from... Where do we have a truck from? Oh, shoot. I'm sorry. I accidentally turned that on. Uh, let's see. No. Turn that. Click that. Oh, come on, game. You can do better than that. Email. Oh, brand new Peterbilt. Oh, from Reno. Yeah, so, a Nevada truck. Hold on a second, guys. I'm flying out of control. I need to sit in this lane. Yeah, a Nevada trailer and a Nevada truck. So we fit into the crowd very well with all the Nevada cars. But once we go into California, it won't be the... I seriously thought we were going on cruise control, so I, like, let go of the gas. Which means the nav, we have speed to catch up on. Just luckily this is only a one-ton trailer. Otherwise, uh, we'd be in a lot of trouble. Because we would have to, like, be hauling this... We'd be hauling 20 tons and we'd be having... We'd have to, like... We would have to, like... Like, the truck would have to waste a lot of gas. I mean, it's wasting a lot of gas now. Just look at the, the uh... We just wasted like a fifth of a tank in not in not even a hundred miles. So we are wasting uh, gas as we should be. Now we're headed into California, although we're not in California just yet. But even though we're headed into California, hold on a second, guys. I need to slow down because we're gonna go out of control if we don't. Watch California will be like around like another bend or something like that. I don't know. Let me see if I can figure California. Uh, yeah, because right now we'd be going through a desert, not going through. Because at one point throughout the drive from the Nevada border to Truckee, there's like a small 
deserty area, but they didn't implant that into the game. I figured this out on Google Street View, by the way. Yeah, there isn't, and we'll discover that when we go past when we go past Truckee and Cross Country Flight. If we survive going through Los Angeles and whatnot, which I hope we did. In oh shoot. Let's just leave it at 55, because we're going into California right now, where the speed limit will be 55. See what I mean? Speed limit's 65, but for us trucks, it's 55, which means we gotta slow down. Which we did. So straight past Truckee. Because we don't need to stop there. If we don't need to stop there, there's no reason to go. Uh, so... This looks interesting. What's going on here? I'm on my brakes now. I don't know if I'm going to stop in time. Uh, looks like I am. Looks like I am. What are you guys doing? War Mr. Werner. Come on, guys. Six o'clock, man. There's no suspect. No Heck, I'm not sitting behind you. Heck, I'm going around you. I mean, you're not. Shh. Well, I wish there would have been a little bit of warning for you when I um came. All right, so six percent wear and tear. So we'll need to eventually get it to a repair shop. Maybe in bar style, I'm not sure. As we go past Werner here. Apparently we don't have the air horn. Shoot, I kind of reacted fast. Uh, Mr. Werner, you need to go. Because if you don't, I'm gonna like lose control of the truck. Thanks. It's just what other truckers will do to make sure that you stay on the right path. They will sacrifice their time. Just to make sure that you can stop... Not stop time in the game, but... We'll go to 57 and then... I'll put on cruise control. Oh, it looks like we're not even going to get to 57 because we slowed down. We've, we're slowing down but below 55 now. Okay, but we, do, we don't need lights anymore. So we'll turn those off. Okay, so... Now, of course, we're going at 57, so there's 57. We'll now lock in the cruise at that speed, and we'll cruise. This is a pretty long trip. I mean, just look, we've got 12 hours of game time left before we even get to bars. So 12 hours of game time's a lot. That'll change to like 11 or 10 hours of game time, obviously, but... I thought we had an automatic retarder on this thing, but this thing isn't slowing down. Uh, I gotta see if there's an automatic retarder. Let's see. Ah, uh, we went into the world map instead of the uh, menu. So, let's go into the menu. This will give my arm a break from holding the steering wheel in such a way that the wheel stays straight. Oh, we'll head into the controls. Not the controls, the gameplay. Oh, where does it say automatic retarder? Uh, it says we have an automatic retarder, but I don't know. Oh well, we'll just have to drive. Continue driving at least. Now, we're going off the exit, so 
I need to go late, switch lanes. Then we need to slow down. Because this is a clover leaf. Shoot. <laughs> oh, shoot. At least we got a chance to read the trailer while we're sitting. Alright, guess what? Let's get back on the road. Shoot. <laughs> Alright, well, I reset the, uh... I reset the steering, sort of. Uh, so I'm gonna... So let's see if it works now, guys. So you can see there's no one behind me for some weird reason. We'll just enjoy that and get on the road. Knowing that we didn't hold anyone up with our shenanigans, Whoa, there's a lot of traffic on this road. Just look at it. Yeesh, it's 8 o'clock in the morning, and there's like 10 million cars on the road. Jeez, that target truck is speeding. I'm trying to get up to the same speed as the truck in front of us so that we can pass him, maybe. But, I don't know if he's going faster than 55 or not. Probably is, because the car... He's probably not, because the car is passing him. So, he's probably going the speed limit. Copper. Pulled over California State Trooper. When we get to 55... Welcome to Sacramento. Well, well, that's very nice of them. Uh, this ambulance is going to make it difficult to pass the truck, but I'm not stopping. We're going past the truck. But it looks like everyone's stopping, and there's no one behind me, so no reason to signal. Let's go. Oh, shoot. We shouldn't have gone back behind the ambulance. We should get in this lane. Maybe we'll see if we can pass the ambulance. Doesn't look that way, but it looks like the... The ambulance is going the exact same speed. But now that it's 65, he's going to speed up, and we're not. So we're going to move over now, because now the speed limit's 65. For the cars, but 55 for the trucks. So, let's stay at 55. wonder why if it's 55 for California and 80 for Nevada and Arizona. Maybe it's probably because Nevada is a very, very... It's probably one of the top five most, uh... It's probably one of the top five least populated states in America. I'm not sure if that's true, but it's probably one of the... And California is the most populated. I think New York is the most densely populated. Not city, but not state. No, it's New Jersey's the most densely populated state. My bad. California's just the most populated. Alright, so people getting off at Stockton. It's just cooler to drive here in multiplayer, but multiplayer is cooler if you want to, like, hang out with actual, like, players. Like, real players, like not players controlled by a, a computer algorithm. So that's cool, and we're getting off here, so we better switch lanes. Alright. No one's getting off at this exit, everyone decided to get off at the other exit. There's not even anyone behind me. What does that sign say there? Just say... Let me see. Hold on a second, because all I gotta do is go into free cam, and they can wait. 
I just discovered this that you can go into. Well, I just figured this out that you can go into free cam. Dream drink. So obviously Coca Cola pun. Oh goodness, goodness again. Now we can go. Oh shoot. <laughs> This is hilarious. Uh, Mr. SUV, I wouldn't have gone even if I were you. And knowing me, you don't really think that I would have. Now we'll speed up a little to just catch up with the others. Because we can. And uh, now we'll slow down. Oh, you're kidding me, guys. I hope you guys are making right turns. Because I'm not going to really fancy it if some of you guys are making lefts, which it looks like all you guys are making rights, which is very convenient for me, because I'm making a right, too. I mean, I can only make a right, considering the fact that I am a... the player, not the AI. Alright, so... As we take our dirty trailer, shoot, well, doesn't matter because it's going to be 55, but the speed limit will be 55 now. So it doesn't matter, I mean, geez, it's going to get us there faster, and it's not going to, like, get us there any slow. So yeah, dream drink. Obviously, since, due to the font of that um, wording, it was obviously pun on Coca-Cola. Which you can change if you get the which, and you can change that to actual Coca Cola if you uh if you get a mod which I don't know what mod it is it is a real company mod but real company mods seem to uh, bring back Bushnell Farms and all that so I decided to just take it out I would rather I would rather have Coast uh, and the Alright, well, anyway, what else should we talk about, uh, oh, right, I forgot about the multiplayer adventure, so, yeah, uh, yesterday morning, I was doing some multiplayer trucking, and, uh, I was just driving along, minding my own business, when all of a sudden, I was like, I missed my turn, so, I, and instead of going to the next exit, which was, a which was, like, a long way away, probably, because, if it was real life, I would obviously just pull through, first of all, because it's real life. Second of all, because the next exit would not be more than, like, two miles away where I live. But, this game, you need to do, you need to do illegal things in this game if you make a wrong turn. So, what I did was that there was no crash barrier near the exit, so I just pulled a U-turn on the, on that side of the road, so that, uh, I could go out back on the exit. I should have just made a U-turn and gone on the other exit side of the, on the other side of the road to make the exit. But instead, I did two U-turns. And the and there's and of course there has to be a multiplayer trucker coming down the uh, coming down the interstate just at that moment. And he comes onto the Unicom, and he yells out, "F you!" He actually said the word though. So, yeah, and I'm, and then in the chat, I'm like, yeesh, no need to swear, I just made a wrong turn. He didn't respond back. So I think it was a good move on my part. Or maybe he just didn't want to talk anymore because he was too far away. Which is a weird thing about multiplayer chat, because when you're, uh... When you're with the multi... When you're in the multiplayer, you can only chat with people that are, at least, that are 700 meters away. Of real distance, not American truck sim distance. Because American truck sim distance, a mile is like a mile is only like three feet in this game. Okay, a mile is fifty feet in this game, but real meters. So if you're if you're like more than a thousand meters away, you. Can't of real distance, which is like 10 miles, which is like 9 mi like 7 miles of game distance, you can't talk to a player. 
But if you're closer than a thousand meters, you could talk to the player. Yes, so then I went on later that day to do some more racing, more race, and I did the racetrack, and, and uh, <laughs> I get to the racetrack, and then I decided later, well, I had spawned myself in Phoenix so that I could do it, and I decided, let's go back to Phoenix and grab my quick job load and bring it around the track. So, I went all the way back to Phoenix and grabbed my my a 19 ton trailer of silica from coastline mining and i drove it all the way back to tucson to the racetrack i show up with my 19 ton trailer and i start to race around and the, there's a guy if you didn't if you didn't realize in my last ep in my uh in the episode where i raced around the racetrack uh uh what is shit what happened uh what happened? Um, I forget. Um, oh right, there was a um. In the middle of the track, there's like this um. This like pyramid, and it's squared on the t this pyramid-shaped concrete block with this, but it's squared on the top, and uh, it was kind of a ramp, and a truck got stuck on the ramp, and the guy in the chat is like, "Help me!" And I'm like, "On my way." And then I had to go through the track with my 19-ton trailer. I was afraid he was going to think, this guy is taking forever to get to me. And so I say in chat, after I park the trailer, I'm coming now, just to make sure that he wasn't thinking. He's not coming, he's just lying. And so I came, and I tried to get him down. But, even though it was a heavy truck that I was hauling, a truck that I was hauling, um... We couldn't- I couldn't seem to get him off the ledge. So I just decide to enjoy racing a little bit. And, uh, some other guy comes as I begin to race again. And I'm like, um, some guy flipped. Can you help him? And he starts helping him while I'm racing around the racetrack. And eventually, with my 19-ton load, I literally just flip in the middle of the track. And I'm on my side. And so the three of us go to service together to see each other, and eventually we're like, this was fun, let's do this again one day. And so 6 p.m. Central, I mean 6 p.m. Eastern Time, 10 p.m. Zulu, tomorrow. And since now you guys are probably going to watch this by tomorrow, you guys are probably not going to watch this for like two weeks um, after I tell you this, but... I'm going to do it, and maybe I'll put more updates to you guys. If you guys, I know only one classmate who has American, tr who has Euro Truck, and I don't even know if he has American Truck. Hopefully, he does. If not, then you know the drill. We just have to. S except I forgot to ask the guy what server. Oh no! I actually realized this earlier, so that's not a surprise for now. I was. Whoa! Oh, I, oh no! We don't know what server to see him on. He was on. We I saw him on the U.S. Uh, uh, U.S. Uh, on the uh, U.S. server. No, uh, the time where the guy told the guys the um the guy who who yelled F you on the track. That was actually his voice on the, um, multiplayer. That was in European server, because I did it in, like, what Europeans would time, so, because all the kids were probably at school. Not me, because I don't go back to school for two weeks. Uh, speaking of school, I don't know what I'm going to do with recording when school starts again. And your answer, your, 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 uh, your suggestion is obvious, weekends only, but I'm not doing weekends only. Jeez, this is a commitment. I'm gonna do it. Along with school, this is a commitment, and we have to go along with it. So, I need to think of something to, like, figure a way to solve this, uh, dilemma. Alright, so... Speed camera! If you guys saw that, if not, then... Boo hoo to you. 
let's see. This is a cool view sometimes. Shoot, there's a guy who wants to pass. We better move over for him. Jeez! Last time I checked the time, it was like noon. And it's already 3 o'clock. Jeez, time flies in this game. Oh shoot, we forgot about gas. Hold on a second, guys. How much gas do we have? 149 gallons. Is the next gas station close? Let's see. No, that's a gas station... The next gas station is not close, so we must get off here at the Irving. There's a car fueling up. Alright. Whoa. Hold on, guys. While we're out of this guy's way, let's reset the, uh... The, uh... Steering. See if that works, which it sure did. Uh, okay, so let's get on the highway. Oh shoot, this is gonna be fun. Let's see. We'll let UPS go, but we won't let the other car go. Get it, cargo. Well, I just came up with the joke, but cargo. I won't let the car go. I won't let the car go go. I mean, jeez, this is my car go. Oh, shoot. This isn't good. This isn't good. We're out of control, everyone. Man battle stations. California Patrol luckily didn't see that because he would have, like, done it for... Oh, never mind. American Long Haul only, um... Figures out reckless driving. Alright. Shoot. Okay, stop, stop, stop the truck. Stop. No, don't stop it. Just slow it down. There. It doesn't matter because just look it up ahead. The trucks are slowing down. It's everyone. It's traffic. Alright, let's stay in this lane, because we can. We're not going to Los Angeles. Yeah, plus, we weren't getting off the exit, so... We had to go. It's getting traffic-y, first of all. Los Angeles during rush hour is the... Um, if you want to avoid traffic and you go to Los Angeles in rush hour, that's the worst, that's the dumbest mistake ever. Cruise control's on now. Because Los Angeles during rush hour, forget about it. Especially 101, which I don't think is even in the game. That doesn't even stretch. I think it just goes to Santa Cruz or something like that. But yeah, the 101. Traffic is insane. And this is Interstate 5. This is nothing. Considering what it would be at this time on a Wednesday. So this car is going to Los Angeles, obviously. Um, oh, he's not going to Los Angeles. Oh, wait. Hold on a second, guys. This isn't even Los Angeles yet. This car is going to Los Angeles, though, because he wants to get off this exit. Um. 
Los Angeles and Carlsbad. We're actually moving pretty fast. The truck would be going like 10 miles an hour slower. Probably, I'm not sure. Don't quote me. Let's see, so... By the way, uh, I did find the Hollywood sign, or what is called the World of Trucks sign. Because obviously they can't, um, they don't have licensing to put the Hollywood sign, so instead they put the World of Trucks. Because they have license to that, I mean, they created it for heaven's sake. World of Trucks. World of Trucks. This is it. Don't get it, because a lot of these companies that I'm seeing on the road are just, like, not, uh... Are not, um, like, location realistic. I mean, Warner Enterprises is supposed to be, like, near where I live in Connecticut. Greyhound isn't supposed to be this, uh... Greyhound is just supposed to be this, uh, plentiful on the roads. I haven't seen a Greyhound bus since in... I've maybe seen, like, three Greyhound buses in, like, the past month. You might think that that's because I don't travel much, and it is. Well, I do travel, but... Not as, like... No one really travels that much. Except for maybe certain people who have them... Who can do it, huh? Don't really know. This Arby's gonna have a chance to pass. Look, the lag is real. If this is a school bus. Uh, if it's a school bus, I can't blow my air horn at it. Which is very sad. I think they must have removed the air horn and update. Hold that down. I'm not sure what they did with the air horn. I must not have read the update clearly enough or something like that. I'm not very sure about it. Alright, guys, well. And Food Line is supposed to be in the east. You're probably thinking, but even yes, yeah, stay. I'm gonna pull over because I did find the Holland World of Truck sign, so I'm gonna pull over and I'm gonna show you where it is using free cam. Because we are not going anywhere near it, location wise. So. Oh shoot, that's gonna make people not wanna pass by, so. Let's see, which way is it? Uh, I think it was this way, don't worry, because. It was that, there in the very corner. Alright, so. Hold on a second, uh. It was across there, back here, past here. I think it was over here, yeah, it was here. It's over there. I'll show you where it is, uh... It's over here. You'll see it. Can you see it? There it is, guys. The World of Trucks sign. Right now, everything needs to load. Okay, after the RV. The car can wait. Or maybe it can't. Or maybe it can. Cool. Oh, come on. You said you could wait. It's a drag race between me and a red car. And it doesn't go down. It doesn't go down in flames, but it doesn't go down in... No, I'm not gonna turn on my lights yet, because I'm just not. Yeah, I did show you guys, like, when you, when you go into a car, the car alarm goes off. I did show you that, right? Yeah, I did. Um... Passing by Wolbert now. Wolbert. Wolbert sounds like an undercover name that like Walmart uses. Like 
Walmart One calling. Walmart One. I mean, Walbert One calling. Walbert. Walmart One calling. Walbert One. Walbert One here calling. Walmart One. Walbert One. I need you to help. Walmart One. Wait, you can me. All right, Walmart One. Walbert One is on to the rescue. And that's just basically how it goes. Oh shoot! 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 Come on, you guys! Look, it's so be a lame. Oh, when this rescaling update comes. When this rescaling mod comes, guys. Oh no, we're stuck. <laughs> this is hilarious, guys. <laughs> Just pull over and hopefully let's make sure that uh accident goes well. I mean the make not well, but well let's hope that Oh no! Now those people aren't gonna know like whether let's make sure the accident went well. Let's make sure that everything's cleared up here. Above here. Oh just look at North American just like stopped. Well, traffic is considerably flowing. So I think it's safe to say that uh Everything worked out. Alright. Now, because we knocked on these signs, which was... No one's coming! So... Let's go. Got plenty of fuel. We should get to Barstow by sundown. Oh, we're getting off, we're getting on here. Whoa, that truck went fast. It's getting on the other highway fast, I should at least say. Someone who wants to pass me, which is, um... So now we'll turn on lights, even though no one else turned on their lights. Because it's, like, literally, it's really getting dark, so... Oh shoot, this guy is, like... In real life, he would've, like, been already up the hill by now, this car. But, in this game, he holds back. So traffic is lightened up a little bit. He decided to move to change lanes early because he didn't have to pass me because I was in the shoulder. Oh, no! Oh, oh no. Stop the truck! When, when, what happens when you smash into an ingrown palm tree on the side of the road? <laughs> Let's just pull over quickly. And just, uh, make sure that the truck works. Uh, let's make sure that cars are going to pass us. Let's stay on this lane just to make sure that uh, the car can pass us. And now we move over in front of the RV. Ugh, looks like this isn't gonna work out. Hold on a second. Um, all right. So as we finish up our trip to Barstow. Oh, no.
this isn't gonna end good at all. And we still haven't even found a repair shop. For the, uh... Great, there's a... S there's a traffic light. That we gotta stop at. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot! Come on, Mr. Truck. You can, uh... Do it. Uh, Alright. Let's pull up to the stop. I mean, to the traffic light. Hello, guys. I got distracted by that light. <laughs> now remember, there's no warning in America. There's no yellow light to warn you to go. Not like Europe, so you have to stay alert. For example, all right, so RV's going to start moving, so. We better move over. Now, because of that traffic light, our arrival in Barstow is now delayed. So I'm putting my foot down, I don't care about the speeding tickets. Or that crash offense. I just need to get to my destination. Idiot. He should have pulled out earlier and then I would have slowed down. Right? So, here we are at our exit. This looks like the end, let me just make sure. Uh, maybe not. I might do some Asphalt 8 for you guys. And I might put it on YouTube. Put a race on this. So. More below when that stop sign. Doesn't look like anyone's coming. Okay, here we are at HMS Machinery. Just click the button, have it park it for us. And the load's delivered. We can now put some more fragile cargo point in there. And here's our load we just brought. And now it's time to get a new load. Because, you know, that's how it works in this game. Load, bring a load, bring a load, bring a load. I would see if I could get a truck f and see if I could hire some drivers because we haven't done that yet. But, yeah. <laughs> Good luck with that because the place is closed. Bakersfield. Nope. Central. Nope. 
Sacramento, no, Eureka, yeah. But that's too long of a trip to do in this episode, so we're gonna have to pause it and do it. Now, before we head to there, we need to first, uh, head to the repair shop, which is along the way, which is nice and convenient for us. Are somebody just okay? So now that load's gonna get nice and painted, nice and fresh in the morning, obviously, because they didn't expect it until then. All right, so All right, so 29 miles an hour. We'll do it on this road because this load is just—it's just too long of a trip to do. I would do it, and I'm going to see how long it is, and then compare it to this trip, which was 15 hours long, not 15, it was, hold on, I'll do it after the repair. Alright, so let's see, so it was 3... It was, no, it was 4 a.m., 5 a.m., 6 a.m., 7 a.m., 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 8. That was 14 hours of game time. Meaning that if we were to do a 16-hour trip, it would end up being over 2 hours. So, no way. We could do that in another episode. So, let's continue on our way to where we need to go. Alright, so. Of course, there's got to be a light. Which we've got to go through because we don't have time to wait for it. I mean, there's no one at the intersection. So, we have, well, we really had no one to wait for. So, it doesn't really matter. That fine should have been in place because the light should have changed, but there's no sensors. Oh, shoot. Nearly hit that station wagon just then. Alright, well, I'm going to zoom now because we can. I just want to get to the test station. To our rail export. Shoot, 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 shoot. No, 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 What was the, uh... What was the, uh, McDonald's one? Looks like I'm gonna have to find it in the freight market, cause... French fries. Yeah, what about getting nuggets for the McDonald's? I mean, that's not even the real McDonald's trailer. The McDonald's trailer doesn't have Ronald McDonald's scary, uh... Doesn't have Ronald McDonald on it. Yeah, there's Ronald McDonald. Real McDonald's trailers don't have Ronald McDonald on it. Real McDonald's trailers have the McDonald arch and... Maybe some fries and joy. And, but that's about it. So this is the McDonald's load. Yeah, the, actually, you just picture McDonald's. I don't know who that guy in the red hair is, but whatever. So this is our a load, oh, 20 tons of goods. That's a lot. Uh, let's let it even. There's a TGI Fridays over there. We'll just pull this up. Yeah, see, 16 hours. And by the time we edit that, it, that could possibly end up being 18 game hours. So what we're going to do is we're just going to pull up to the stop sign. 
turn off the engine, put it on the parking brake, put down the steering wheel, and look at the trailer again. Well, that is all. In the next episode, is that music? It, was a, it must have been a hallucination. I mean, not a hallucination. Yeah, probably a hallucination. Well, that's all. Let's get trailer as soon as we thought. Yeah, it does. Does it? Yeah, it does. Anyway, now we're going to set this up. Yeah, in the next episode, we will go to... Um, we'll go to um, Eureka. Um, yeah, well... We won't head up this way because we never do that. Except maybe I want to show you the, uh... We'll just show you the, uh... I just want to show you the Bates Motel because you guys never got to see that. Uh, we'll head up this way. Hold on a second. It thinks that, like... Hold on a second. Uh, I wish it... You should... That you could tell it to, uh... This should not be two. This should be two. Yes, so that'll work because I want to show you Bates Motel because you haven't seen it and I want you guys to see it. Here we'll pull off a detour. We'll pull off the exit and head up 580 past San Rafael, past Ukiah. Which we'll go through and probably not be able to discover, and we will eventually make it to Eureka. So, that's all. I'll see you guys. So, guys, let's just uh, go into free cam and I'll uh, do a. Uh, we'll head over to the highway and we'll do a nice view of the highway or the, egg of the exit ramp for a little bit because I now know how to, how to do that. And I also figured out, you can also click, go to, you'll see how to do it, go to, let's do Vegas. Watch what happens, it's going to now take us to Vegas. Which, this is basically what you need to think about. So that's it. Okay, I gotta see you guys in the next episode. So let's... Come on, game. Come on. Come on. Alright, so then we're going to click quit. Goodbye. I'll see you guys Friday for another episode of, I don't know, hopefully Christmas shopping sim simulator.